How do you do a dual battery setup on the cheap? Well, for this trip here, I've been camping out of this sedan vehicle. Now, normally I'm in my four-wheel drive, so it's got a dual battery system, so I can power all of my camera batteries, my laptop, drone batteries, all that kind of stuff. But since I'm filming out of this car here, I kind of had a bit of an issue, because I was like, how am I gonna power everything? How am I even gonna power my camp lights for recording at nighttime? And then I was like, what if I just do a dual battery system that's super simple? and I'll show you guys what I came up with. This is the starting battery for the vehicle and I've connected this 70 amp cable and that runs down into the car and then the cable runs through here, past the seal and into the cab of the car. And that big thick red cable ends up right here onto this alligator clip. So what I do when I'm about to start the car and start driving, I just simply plug this onto there and that means that the battery is being charged by the alternator. And then when I pull up and I stop driving, I park the car, I just put it back onto this plastic tab. So that's how I've been doing the dual battery setup. This earth here is just hooked up to a bolt up in the footwell there. And that's earthed through that bolt there because that's got an earth through to the chassis. This cable here goes through to the inverter and that's the positive for that cable. And then we've also got just an Anderson plug, which I use to plug in the solar panels. I've got the solar panels outside hooked up right now. And we've also just got this 12 volt cigarette socket for charging all my other appliances that can't be charged through the inverter. Unfortunately, I didn't have any of the proper battery terminal things to put onto the terminals. So I've just used a bolt and a nut to hold all of the lugs from the cables together. And then the bolt just goes down onto the battery terminal and I'm using a hose clamp to hold it on. Super simple idea, but it's worked awesome. And that battery in there, that's just one that I had laying around the house and it still holds some charge, so it was a perfect battery for the job. Now admittedly, none of the cables in there are fused, which is bad and you should never do that. I'd never recommend it. But for a three day trip, I wasn't gonna worry about fusing it because I just didn't think it was worth the expense. That being said, if you added some fuses, it's a perfect temporary dual battery system. And if you got a battery, some cable, a couple of lugs lying around, you can quite easily set up a dual battery system like that. It cost me about $20 to set that dual battery system up because I had a fair bit of the stuff I needed to do it lying around the house. Anyway guys, that's how you can do a dual battery system on the cheap. Seek adventure!